been a minute but I'm back with some more videos um to update you from the last video if you didn't check it out check it out please guys um so I got a little cold too boy getting sick nothing new holidays weather changing you know um the last video reinstalled the door cards but I currently took them back off because uh, one thing first thing first I want to get speakers and I don't feel like pulling them back off again install them and put them back on there and then take them back off again um so I'm gonna wait till I get the speakers sometime the beginning of next year going before the end of this month of next year so I should have speakers and whatnot for this car possibly a head unit um or I'll probably just use what I have I have to see I have to see if I still have those or not. I don't know how good they are. We shall see. But um on today's video though, today's video it's not a sponsored video, but it's a video on NERG um wheel wheel hub. Um I gotta I gotta disconnect a short hub. <clears throat> so I'm gonna talk up loud for you guys. And a ignition switch. Um, the old ignition switch, which is right here, as you can see, I didn't have keys for the old one, so I went out, bought a brand new one, and this is an old steering wheel that I had back when I had the GTI, um, when my brother had a GTI, and then I got it from him, so let's just say we both had it, or more so like he had it, but anyway, um, I'm currently going to use this steering wheel on this car, it's a little small, I mean, yeah, a little dusty too. It's got to clean it up. Like I said, I ain't never used it. I had it for years. So I'm going to use that steering wheel. And if I want to get another one, I get another one down the road. But um, for the most part, I got all this. I have to find my turn signals. And I got to put them back together and put that on here too. All right, guys. So I'm set up inside the car. I'm going to try to make this simple as possible. You take this ignition switch. You're supposed to set it in the hole right here, right? And then, once that's set, you take the bottom piece and mount it up underneath of here. And pretty much, that's how you mount it up there. I mean, you got everything mounted, so... Now, I can go ahead and put on this little plastic piece. Which ain't nothing but turn signals. So... I'm gonna add that on it now. Then we get to the steering wheel. Oh yeah, by the way, I cleaned that up a little bit. Plus clean up the, um, the turn signals. And now that's one side turn signal. I gotta find the other side. Once I do, I'll add that to it. Might have to order a new one. Might have threw it out. I don't know. I had plans on buying all new this, but eh, money's getting tight. So now I'm gonna go into these hub pieces all right so just to update you guys i gotta take that plastic piece back off and put this little cap piece on top of it and we should be good to go but i'll do that when i get back in the car so let me see take this bad boy out got a couple more instructions stickers that's cool look at the rest of the stuff later Throw these stickers up here because I'm put them on there with the rest of the collection. Hmm, they gave me screws. Well, some more instructions. Wow. Short hub meat. Other oh, extension hub. So I'm taking it's gonna go on just like that. So that's the way I got it set up so far. Just put the short hub on, the little bolt. Now I'm about to take this piece and throw it on the inside like so for all the wiring. I don't know what this little piece do, but eh. Okay. Hook this up together like so and screw it down with the bolts. And yeah, that should be it. I'll let you guys know what it looks like when I'm when I get that part on. 
it should be like fairly simple. So, so there goes the product stand to that. Now, just gonna mount the steering wheel and we shall be good. Good, good, good. I don't think I'm, okay. I don't know if I'm gonna use this button or not. I'll see, see how I feel. I mean, looks a little gay, but at the same time, I can always put something else there, I guess. Nah. Nah, I don't need that to be that nice. I mean, there goes that. That was a little flush. So, it could go like that, like that. Let me know down in the comments if you like it like that or without the button. I like it without the button, so. I mean, I ain't really too worried. I can always hook up a horn button or something somewhere else, so. Oh, so, this video just went to bummer. I just realized that the steering wheel does not match the hub. And I'll show you what I mean. So the first bolt go in, right? But the other bolts are off. Which makes this the wrong steering wheel. So I can't use that one for a 240. It means I have to order one. Oh well. At least I got this far. I got that installed today. Um, so stay tuned for that. And the steering wheel. I'm not even going to videotape. I'm just going to do it all. Two second video. Probably off camera. But I am going to put this piece onto the hub. Voila, it is installed. So, I want to tell you guys thanks for commenting and all that good stuff down below and um you guys take care i'm not feeling too hot and i still got a lot more stuff i gotta clean up off the floor then wrap this up and get out of here come in tomorrow if i feel better so we can do more stuff for the 240s stay tuned to the next episode you probably already guess what it's gonna be but let me know that in the comments take a guess Later guys.